for a vehicle that broke an axle or something out in San Hollow near the reservoir. We're gonna head out there and see if we can get it out. We got head with the weather. Yeah, it's a little cloudy, not much of a breeze, but it's hot. We got those guys. Back here with Brett. Hi. He's taking Lizzie's place today. All right, so we found the truck and I reached out to the customer and they're gone. They disappeared. So we've got probably a 30 minute wait for the customer to get here. So here's a little secret for you A students. If you call for a tow truck and your plans change, reach out to them and let them know what's going on. So while we're waiting for the customer, we're gonna get all hooked up here and see if we can get this out. Let's see what the damage is. They said they got a broken CV joint. That one seems okay. I wonder which one's broke. Drive shaft's in good shape. 65 PSI. <laughs> we're gonna build ourselves a bridle out of one of these, this 20 footer. Think they're pretty stuck. Yeah, but a lot. Take the key with them, lock it up, and leave. You know. I, mean. I think we're gonna go downhill for a second, like in front of where that red Jeep is, before we turn and go up. I don't know what you're gonna be able to do to help. Probably just rear wheel drive. How's it going? Hey. Sorry for the way we had to drop out the kids, pick up the Tahoe, and everything. Okay. Nice to meet you guys. How's it going, man? Yeah. I appreciate it big time. So we think it's got kind of broken axle. It's, it's plunking all over the place right yeah. now. Okay, I'm gonna find the end of my rope. Okay, and I'm gonna hit the end of my rope when I back up, and then you see me start to go, start rolling on the throttle. truck. today too. Yeah. Oh, yeah? yeah, let's pull you out. It's a broken drive line. 
Yeah, that was the front. My bad, mine went out. Oh, See, that, that it's probably like four months too. old. Like four months old. <laughs> on the heavy wrecker. <laughs> I got a little dicey there for a second. Did you yeah. see that? Yeah, I did. So that's not too bad for an afternoon's work, is it, Ed? No, not too bad. Nobody got hurt or got them out, and they were happy. So we got a call for a car that is stuck on the Babylon Mill Road. We're gonna head out there and pull them out of there. We got Trevor again with the weather. It's about 80 something degrees. Pretty nice day, no wind, perfect. We got Skeeter back there. They're in the usual spot. He's gonna be doing the unusual thing. We're gonna strap a rope around him and he's gonna pull him out. It's gonna be a good day. Hey, matching shirts. Yeah. Yep. It overheated. We tried to get out a couple times and brought it back and it shut off. It turns on now. It's been off for a while, but it runs now. It just was pretty toasty. Did it boil over this, that you know of? Not that I know of. Okay. being Lizzie. There's no way, man. I need like 20 less years and I could never ride a horse that good either. Can you? Sleep anywhere though? Uh, not as good as her. Since you guys are into matching shirts, come up here. <laughs> Normally only get one shirt, but because they had the XL? matching shirts. Uh, <laughs> get XL or, uh, do you have double XL? If not, mm -hmm. I'll take an XL. See? There's not one because Lizzie doesn't do this. You're Lizzie today, right? Yeah, so yeah, now it's my go, fault. Lizzie. Oh, man. <laughs> Saving our bacon and giving us a shirt for it. <laughs> you guys have a great day. Thank, Thank you, you. So, so how much. do we how do we pay for this? Uh, uh we're not charging today. Are you serious? No. Yeah. No way. Have a good one. Wait, no way. Are you kidding? Huh? Huh? Since you have matching shirts and all. Yeah. Holy cow. Thank you so yeah. much. Thanks. Oh my gosh. Wow. Well, that wasn't too hard. Skeeter did a passing job as the... Lizzie. Lizzie. We appreciate him for stepping up, stepping up like that. Lizzie's on some vacation in Nevada, going to some kind of a promenade. Promenade? The Cowboy com prom. Cowboy promenade. Isn't prom just short for promenade? I think so. All right. So we got a call for a truck and a trailer stuck out here to Sand Hollow. We're gonna head out here, see if we can get it pulled out of there. Trevor with the weather. It's about 70 degrees. We're out here before it gets in the 90s, so that's good. And plus there's no wind. It's always a good day when there's no wind in the sand dunes. Got Lizzie back there to help with the recovery. And we got Skeeter probably gonna be helping with the little camera work. It's gonna be a good day. Good morning. Oh, well, I guess so. <laughs> okay, we'll go get him. Thank you. She must be new. She must be new. She seems very pleasant though. Yeah. Oh, I was hoping for a challenge. <laughs> we could use a challenge. Yeah. Okay, Lizzie, let's come in and get, get in there and get familiar with it. 
Which way, which direction are you going? Oh, I should probably, I don't even bring him up here on the hard pack. Lemon squeezy. All right. Are we gonna pull him up to the road? What's that? Are we pull no, him up he's to the he's good here. There's a path, a good path in and out of here. He doesn't want to be on a camera, but he's still getting a. Uh... Look how uh, look how glassy smooth this is. Yeah, it's beautiful fish. Should be out fishing. Fishing. What kind of fishing you like? One where you throw bait in the water and the fish grabs it and then you reel it in. Well, that was fun. A day in the dunes means a day in the shop. One wasn't too bad. I was hoping for a little more of a struggle, but we just kind of hooked up to it and pulled it out. Thanks for watching.